Since leaving the royal family the Duke and Duchess of Sussex have pursued various projects and big entertainment deals, with varying levels of success. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle may have ruffled feathers during their time working with Netflix, according to a source, following a turbulent period in their fortunes as their £15 million deal with Spotify comes to an end. The pair have been producing new content for Netflix with two upcoming projects after their docuseries Harry and Meghan brought in huge numbers for the streaming platform last December. As always smash the like button and subscribe to this channel, this way you won't miss our next video in this same channel. However their exposing account of their relationship and life as working royals may have led them to give too much of themselves away, with some suggesting they may need to reconsider their brand to move forward successfully. A Netflix source told Closer magazine, the greatest fear from Meghan and Harry's perspective is that this latest controversy and criticism could be the straw that breaks the camel's back when it comes to what the public thinks of them and how much money they can earn. Things may have to change as far as joint appearances go, and certainly it seems like bashing the royals together is off the agenda now for the foreseeable future. They added that the couple had ruffled feathers during their time at Netflix, saying, Harry is no problem but Meghan thinks she knows how to run Hollywood. Although their docuseries focused predominantly on their personal lives, their two upcoming productions are moving away from royal life and showcasing different voices. Their long-awaited documentary Heart of Invictus is scheduled to be released on Netflix in August, with the program following wounded and sick armed forces members as they compete to take part in the Invictus Games, the brainchild of Prince Harry. They are also said to be producing a new series called Bad Manners, a prequel to the Charles Dickens novel Great Expectations fousing on the character Miss Havisham. But it has not all been plain sailing for the Sussexes as last month it was announced they would no longer be producing any new content with Spotify, with no second series for Meghan's podcast archetypes. A source told the publication that Meghan has been left distraught by the latest accusations that she is not working hard enough. They said, Meghan is distraught over this Spotify snub and the fallout that has followed. It's totally knocked her sideways. She can't believe she's been attacked so viciously and so publicly by one of their execs, and to be labeled grifters is an utterly humiliating and gut-wrenching all-time low it's served as a brutal reality check that things really do need to change to save their popularity. Her team have warned her that there's no future with Harry and that she needs to start working on her individual projects rather than being seen as one half of Brand Sussex. They feel that if Meghan does more on her own, she'll have more opportunities to save her career. It will give them breathing room and restore confidence or at least that's the hope. Remember to subscribe to this channel and turn on the notification bell, this way you will be notified when next we drop a report video in this same channel.